Hello you lovely people. Welcome back to my channel. You know what it's time for guys? It's time to jump back in a way onto this little beauty guys. The Evercade. Uh, I say in a way because I'm actually going to take a look at a game that is coming up on the Evercade next year guys. On the Codemaster Collection. Yeah, the Codemaster Collection 1 will have this game on it. And we're going to take a look at the exact one that's going to be on it. I'm bloody certain of it and I'll tell you why. This game was originally released onto the Amiga guys and onto the Amiga CD. Um, but then it was handed over in 1995 to... The Fantastic Codemasters guys and they released the Mega Drive version of it which is called Super Skid Marks. So yeah it was Skid Marks before for the Amiga and the Amiga CD and then in 1995 the fabulous fabulous oh Codemasters Dizzy guys Dizzy uh, they took over the reins and made the Mega Drive version so by Sod's Law that's the version you're going to get on your fantastic, gorgeous, beautiful, I can't say it enough guys, Evercade by Blaze. That is the version you're going to get on there because that's the Codemasters version. So it's Sod's Law really, isn't it? That's the version you're going to get. So yeah, fantastic game guys. Um, I can tell you now, I haven't touched this bloody game since about 1996, uh, I had it when it was released onto the uh, Mega Drive, or Genesis as it's known in North America. I had it back then when it was first released, and I probably had it for about a year. And back then, I couldn't just afford to go and get games every five minutes, so I traded it in to get the next big fad at the time. Um, so I haven't touched it since then, guys. I've got it again. Um, I bought uh, the loose car at some point and then I got the boxed version as well. They're, they're here somewhere buried in all of this bloody lot here. Um, but I haven't played it. <laughs> I haven't, I, I, oh, it's, it's such a shameful thing to admit. But there's quite a lot of games in here that I've purchased or acquired in lots and what have you. And I haven't actually had the time yet to play them. Because funny enough, uh, yeah, I tend to be making a lot of videos. So I don't get as much time as I'd like to play because I also work. But mm, the Evercade is a godsend to me because it enables me to play games. I can lie in bed while the missus is snoring away. Um, and I can have a play while I'm in bed. So when this, oh, I can't wait for this cartridge to come, guys. Comment below, are you excited for the Codemasters cartridge? Because I flipping am. I couldn't stipulate enough, guys. I can't stipulate enough how much I want that cartridge. Um, I'm very, very excited about it. Um, and then I can play it on my Evercade, guys. Lie in bed and play it. I know, yeah, you can have a telly in your bedroom and you can play your Mega Drive over that if you've got an old CRT. Um, but I don't have one in the bedroom because my missus would flipping kill me if I tried to, you know, play games while she's sleeping. So yeah, this this little baby guy is, is the answer. Oh, and to play Super Skid Marks on here, that already gets me so bloody excited because I can practice and actually get good at it. Not like you're going to see in this next video, I'm bloody sure. I'm used to modern races, guys. I'm not used to the old controls anymore, so I'm going to have to really bloody practice. But yeah, hmm. we're going to have a little taster, guys, of what's to come on the fantastic Evercade and the fantastic, very exciting, can't wait, Codemasters collection, guys. So would you like to join me as we have a little taster of Super Skid Marks? Mm, I think you do, because you know as well as I do. That's the one that's going to be on the flipping cartridge, the Mega Drive version, guys. And it is the superior version. Join me in a sec. There you go, guys, with this fantastic title that's going to make an appearance on the Codemaster collection the Evercade. Super Skid Marks.
As you can see, it is a fantastic little racer, guys. I'm going to be playing it terribly, I'm sure. But there's a little demo for you. Fantastic. All right, here we go. All right, shall we play this thing? Registration. Here you go, guys. That will diddly do for me. Oh, here we go. I'm going through the whole alphabet again. <laughs> It'll probably take longer than anything else. I should just skip through, but then I tend to go past them. If I go too quick. There we go. That will do. Thank you very much. Brilliant. Right, shall we go for champion? Yes, I think so. Or shall we go for marathon match, maybe? Yeah. Well, we'll do both. We'll go for championship first. So here you go, guys. You've got rally racing championship. Surf showdown. Winter Series, Cowboy Fever, Rally Racing again. Right, so we'll go for the Rally Racing first, of course. Right, here we go. Yes, I told you I was going to play badly. Look at that, what a terrible start. Been a hell of a long time since I played this game, guys. I am looking forward to playing it on my other kid and practicing it. Getting good at it again. I did used to be at one time, honestly, and I didn't look like it, but I do. Of course, it's going to be uh, quite a different experience to playing on a Mega Drive, which is what I'm used to. I never had it on a Commodore CD or anything. Whoa. Bugger. That was terrible. <laughs> Absolutely terrible last place. Look at that. Right. <laughs> Terrible. Right, we'll give it one more go here yeah, on this one. Here we go, guys. They put me in front look because I know I'm terrible and I need all the help I can get. It'd be nice not to come last place at least. Isn't this a fantastic looking old game, guys? It really is. It's superb. No way in hell's up I'm ever going to win. Keep hitting those bloody edges. I'm just not used to this kind of racing game anymore. And it's called Masters at their best. I mean, this is just a pure example of what's going to be like playing that fantastic cartridge on the Evercade. And this is the version you're going to get, guys, because Codemasters only made the Mega Drive version. The other versions were not them. Oh, last bloody place again. But, you know what, I think we should try a different course maybe. Yes, I know, thank you very much. So, uh, let's go back, shall we, if we can? So, look, can we go back here? Not looking good. Can we go back? Right, okay. Back in a sec, guys. Unfortunately, I forgot that you've got to uh, <laughs> reset it. Never mind, here we go. We're on uh, Surf Showdown. Let's try this one. You're not going to see me win, it's just looking to destroy what this game is like, guys. Fantastic music as well. 
absolutely fantastic. Here we go at the front again. So they know, they know how crap I am. Let's follow the others because we don't really know the path yet. Uh -huh. Yeah, where we're going now. There we go, yeah. Interesting path. Don't even know if I'm going the right way to be honest, because they're so far ahead I can't see them. Oh dear. Here's a fantastic game, it really is. Where the hell am I going now though? Is a very good question. Oh you bugger. Get around there. <laughs> Oh, that is terrible. Oh, look at me jumping everywhere there. That is so fun though. And I'm completely going the wrong way now. Try and get around here. No, I can't even cheat. Yeah, I'll just let them try and get around quicker. Oh dear. Yes, I'm definitely going to be last place this time. I'm not even sticking to the course. Dear me. I don't know where I'm bloody going here. <laughs> but they've all finished and I'm still going around like a lunatic. Dear me. Am I actually going to end this race or what? Probably not. I'm just going to go around here. Do you believe? Did I end it? No, I didn't. Oh. <laughs> Still going. Oh, seriously, man. Okay, then. Alright, here we go, then. Oh, uh, uh, I'm supposed to... Yeah, I'm supposed to go around that way, you silly sod. Go on. Get up there, you div. Oh, dear me. That was a well-deserved last place, that was. <sighs> well, we know I can't um, quit to another course from here. Dear me. Hmm, terrible, terrible, terrible. Right, back in a sec. Right, here we go with the winter series. It's not going to get any better, is it? Probably worse because there's snow involved, I should think. Here we go. Can't quite remember, guys. But let's have a go anyway. I'm not going to be following the track again. Oh, look at this. I'm going to get so far behind again that I'm not going to be able to see where the blood is going. <laughs> oh, if I could just keep the last one in view so I know where I'm going, that would be good. You can see how the tracks are developing now, can't you? How they're getting there. A little bit harder, shall we say. Oh, crap, they went around that way this time. Okay, then. Not sure if that's... Uh, I'm going the right way now, what? I might have taken a wrong turn, guys. That's what you've got to keep an eye on. If you're playing as badly as me, are you taking a wrong turn? Right. I certainly am. I do believe you know, I'm taking a very wrong turn. Oh, probably not even in the race anymore now. <laughs> oh, dear me. Yeah. This is not a good advert for this game, is it? Watching me play. But I promise you guys, once you've got a bit of practice in it, it's fantastic. The controls are a little bit scary, you know, get used to obviously, and especially if you're playing like I am. That is not a good thing to play. Right guys, here we go as we take a look at the last uh, level guys, um, if you like, in uh, Championship. It's Cowboy Fever. Here we go. I'm sure I'm not going to do any better with this one. Dear God. Right, here we go. Oh, for Pete's sake. Oh, Jesus Christ. I swear to God. 
I'm drunk. Drunk, 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 like a flipping drunk kangaroo. But yeah, at least it gives you a chance to, as I keep saying, guys, to look at this fantastic title. That is coming to the fabulous, fabulous Evercade. Yeah, I'm really going to have to hang my head in shame here. This is terrible. Too much playing modern racing games, guys. I know I keep saying it, but that's why I wanted to hit the Evercade as quick as possible so I can get familiar with it again. Play it lying in bed, that'll be fabulous. And then I can get reacquainted with the controls better. Because I damn well need to, that's for sure. Oh, damn me. Terrible. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, yeah, really is hang your head in bloody shame, isn't it, eh? Oh, yeah, if I could only just not come last, guys, that would be fabulous. Just don't come last. Oh well, I did. That's all there is to it. Uh, we're going to have to go and take a look at uh, yeah, the other bits. Right, back in a sec guys. Here we go. Right, here we go guys then. With Match Race. Yeah, we'll go down to Match Race. We've had a good look at Championship, haven't we? So, yeah, let's move on. Let's see if there's any differences here. I'm still going to play crap. So that's for sure. But again, it gives you a chance to see this fabulous game. Before it hits your Evercade. Yeah, here we go again. Look, bloody drunk kangaroo again. Oh, there's just no freaking hope. I'm sure once I've uh, played it longer than 10 minutes um, on the Evercade itself, I will get familiar with the controls again, guys. Don't let this put you off. This is just me being very crap. Oh. Keep, hit, oh, keep hitting those edges, guys. I'm sure as shot that you're going to play a hell of a lot better than I am. It is a fantastic game. I mean, just look at it. It's beautiful. Controls, yeah, they're all right for somebody who, uh, you know, can play it. Sounds bloody awesome as well, although you can't hear it very well. Unfortunately, uh, yeah, I'm having a bit of trouble with uh, the sound at the moment. Hopefully I'll get that sorted. But yeah, I'm, I'm not doing any better, guys. And this is a very confusing track. Oh, dear God. I'm going to have to play it again. Though. It's good that you can go back here, guys. Um, that is interesting with uh, this this uh, match race, guys. Because you can actually go back without having to reset. So that's fantastic. So you just go to... Uh, yeah. Restart it again. And you can quit it if you want to, which is brilliant to go back to the menu. Right, let's give it another go. Not that it's going to be any better. If anything, it'll probably be worse. Here we go. Oh. Oh, dear me. Look at me bouncing everywhere here. Oh, it's like a pinball. It's like a pinball game. When I play. I keep saying it, guys, don't let it, don't, don't, whatever you do, don't let this put you off. It is fantastic. It really is. Just, uh, yeah. We haven't played it for so long, guys. Um, I'm extremely rusty. With a capital bloody R. Uh, there we go. Hey. Oh, you sod. Yeah, I think I'm actually doing worse than last time. 
Hmm. If that's even possible. Come on, let's just end this race now. Come on, get around the right bloody way. This least it guides you where you should go. Not that I'm paying any attention. So it won't let you go the other way. So that's good. You've got an ounce of common sense, unlike myself. That should help you. Right, there we go then. Hmm, what a surprise I lost again. Dear, dear God. But yeah, there you go, guys. What a fantastic look at this stunning title, guys. And this is just one title that is going to be on this cartridge. It's bloody awesome. It really, really is. As I said, don't let my bad playing put you off. I'm sure you're going to do a hell of a lot better than I did. And it is flipping fantastic it's so nostalgic guys the music the look of it it is bloody beautiful i mean oh fantastic chord masters at their best i mean come on you know they made dizzy games for christ's sakes you know with the oliver twins they took a chance on the dizzy games didn't they there we go again guys back to the uh, beginning again but yeah as i said guys Stunning, stunning, stunning. And there's a hell of a lot more than just this game on that cartridge. What can you say? Can't wait, guys. Can't wait. Literally can't wait for this cartridge. So, yeah, guys, if you've got any common sense, as soon as the pre-order comes up, get your bloody name down for it. Get that cartridge pre-ordered. That's what I'm going to do. Um, definitely going to pre-order this one. I cannot risk missing out on this cartridge. This is just one example of the fabulousness that is on there. So, yeah. Brilliant, brilliant, brilliant. As you can see, look, you've got all these different bits here. You can change your laps from 4 to 8 and blah, blah, blah. Yeah, some nice little uh, options there. Password, of course, as well. So yeah, fantastic there. Right, there we go guys. I should be back with my final thoughts. I know guys, I'm, I, I am literally hanging my head in shame. That was a sorry sack of shit, wasn't it, eh? Ugh. Oh. Please, please, please make it to the Evercade as quick as possible so I can practice. Oh, that was shameful even by my standard. But I tell you what, it gave you a fantastic look at what's to come on that cartridge, guys. I mean, that's just one title. And that was bloody beautiful looking. I mean, oh, the graphics on it are awesome. Uh, the controls, mm, yeah, I'm not coping with them. I'm going to have to practice, guys, very, very much. But then I did say earlier... Um, I haven't touched that game since the very least 1996. Um, so yeah, very long time ago. And I, of course, love racing games and I've been playing all the modern ones. Um, you know, and oh, just some fabulous games out there that are racing games, guys. But I am going to find myself reacquainted with it, playing it on here, because it actually gives me a possibility of playing it. I can lie in bed. I can sit in the bath if I don't drop it in there. I haven't actually attempted that yet, you know. Yeah, comment below. Have you actually used your Evercade in the bath? Have you dared to do it? Because I haven't. But it's an option. Maybe. It might make me cry if I dropped it, but it's an option. Um, yeah, comment below. Have you played it in the bath? I'm just intrigued, really, uh, if anybody's taking the risk. Um, yeah, but I can obviously, like I said, lie in bed, you know, and play it. I can pick it up, you know, and sit in the living room while the missus is watching something on the telly, and I can sit there and play it there as well. Um, so, yeah, can't wait for it to hit the Evercade. Uh, and you know how much I love the Evercade, guys. I can't promote it enough. Did you get an Evercade for Christmas? That's another question I'd like to ask you. Comment below, did you get an Evercade for Christmas? What cartridges did you get with your Evercade? Did you go for the premium pack or just the standard? I'm really intrigued, guys, to know how many Evercades were sold over Christmas because, oh my God, 
it is such a fabulous product that um you know oh they should have sold a bloody ton um but of course you know with covid and everything um people might still be waiting for them to come they might be still sitting in the bloody post i know we haven't had any decent post in flipping weeks um i'm still waiting on quite a few items to come um so yeah did did yours not turn up yet again comment below guys are you still waiting for your christmas present to turn up and yeah with that guys um yeah i hope you enjoyed that little taste of the fantastic cold masters cartridge to come to he grabs it again the fabulous evercade um <clears throat> there's some stellar titles on there guys i mean this is just one of them and we will take a look at some more leading up to the release of it so there you go guys with that i'm going to say the usuals if you're not subbed already please drop me a sub give me a thumbs up if you feel that way inclined and also make sure to tap that bell icon and the all icon guys to get any notifications whatsoever but with that i'm going to love you and leave you love you and leave you slug you and leave you i'm going to love you and leave you i'm going to say our videos in cheers and goodbye guys see you in the next one